Ohioans will have a new decision to make in November, whether or not to legalize the use of recreational marijuana. The Coalition to Regulate Marijuana, like alcohol, put together a proposal outlining the various processes and standards that would be put in place if passed. I spoke with a group spokesperson who tells me they used best practices from other states that have already legalized recreational marijuana and built upon Ohio's existing medical marijuana procedures. So for example, for you, like alcohol, only those 21 and up would be able to buy, grow, and use marijuana. According to the proposal, adults would be allowed to have two and a half ounces of marijuana flour or 15 grams of extract. They'd be allowed to grow marijuana at home with limitations on the amount of plants and you would not be able to sell from home, leaving that to licensed dispensaries. There'd also be a 10% sales tax with a plan on where that money would go. 36% goes into a new social equity and jobs fund, which will do important things like uh, making direct investment into communities that have been disproportionately impacted by marijuana prohibition, you know, to fund and study criminal justice and bail reform and other really important causes. The group's spokesperson there says money from the sales tax would also go to local communities with dispensaries for things like infrastructure projects, even law enforcement budgets. Money would also go towards a substance abuse and addiction fund. That's all according to this proposal. And still headed five for you more details on where exactly, if legalized, marijuana dispensaries and use could take place.